lots of memories just walking through this door here, really. The old sports arena got a special visit today from Ralph Lawler, the voice of the San Diego Clippers. The NBA Hall of Fame broadcaster ended up spending more than 40 years with the team. And he'll be reading from his new memoir tomorrow night at the Central Library. But first, he spoke with ABC 10 News reporter Jeff Lasky about those early Clippers days, his unique style, and the stigma from having worked for disgraced owner Donald Sterling. Welcome back to the sports arena. Yeah, yeah, this is the old, this, this was our, our home. It's been decades since longtime Clippers broadcaster Ralph Lawler has visited what was then known as the San Diego Sports Arena. Everywhere we went brought back old memories. Does it look a lot different now than the days when the Clippers were playing here? About the same amount of crowd. <laughs> the crowds were small because the team was rarely any good. Lawler says that forced him towards what became his signature style, calling the game with a big dose of humor. We win 12 and we lose 70. There's not a whole lot of entertainment value here with this basketball team. We better find a way to provide it. And so th that helped me really turn the corner. Lawler's new book, Bingo, 40 Years in the NBA, shares tons of great stories about his time with the Clippers. It's also very candid, including about his old boss, Donald Sterling. The league eventually forced Sterling to sell the Clippers after recordings of racist comments were released. But Lawler says Sterling's behavior was an open secret. There'd be stories, of these awful stories of uh, terrible things that he was doing. And uh, he's like, ah, I, I, can I work for this guy? But I always felt I was working for the fans, Jeff. I, I really honestly did. And I, thought, I, I love the game, love the sport, love the professional sport, love the NBA, and I thought I'd be foolish to give this up because of, of that guy. Lawler still connects with fans on social media and on this new book tour, a final chapter as he settles into retirement. Time, time just passes you on. It just it does. And it's, uh, this is my time to, to let go of, of, of this. In the Midway District, Jeff Lasky, ABC 10 News. We spoke with Lawler for nearly an hour, filled with stories about his early days with the Clippers, his close friendship with Bill Walton, and more about the challenges of working for Donald Sterling. We are posting the whole thing as a podcast on 10news.com, and you can see Lawler's book tour with Bill Walton tomorrow night at the San Diego Central Library.